Uh, this is question number 22, uh, 2013 KCSE Mathematics Paper 2. And we are told three quantities R, S, and T are such that R varies directly as S and inversely as the square of T. Uh, given that part A, given that R is equals to 480, when S is equals to 150, and T is equals to 5, write an equation connecting R, S, and T. Uh, so, from the statement here, this question is from uh, form 3, uh, uh, that is in variation. Uh, we can be able to get the equation, so we use the first statement, we say, uh, R, we are told R is directly proportional to S and inversely proportional to T squared. So that is what this statement here says uh, from here, here. Uh, that is what the statement. So we can be able to write that this as an equation. R is equals to K S, you divide by T squared. Uh, so we can substitute uh, and say make k the subject k is equals to uh, r multiplied by t squared you divide by s uh, since we have been given the value of r is 490 which is equals to 480 you multiply by t is 5 uh, so 5 uh, squared and you divide by s our s is 150 uh, 150 uh, which you'll be able, if you use your calculator, you'll be able to get 80. So this means k is equals to 80, and therefore uh, now we can write this equation, r is equals to 80, uh, k, that is k, s, divided by t squared. So that is the equation connecting, uh, connecting uh, r, s, and t. Uh, we go to part b. Find the value of R when S is 360 and T is uh, 1.5. Since we have obtained our equation in part A, R is equals to 80, that is K, S is 360, you multiply by 360 and you divide by 1.5 squared. Uh, you can still use here, you use your calculator and you will be able to find that uh, this is 12,800. So there you get two marks. Uh, Roman number two, uh, we are told find the percentage change in R if S increases increases by 5% and T increases by decreases by 20% and you get four marks. So we can say the new R, uh, we use uh, R that, we, that is R with prime is equals to now uh, we have the we have uh, we have k uh, then s s has increased by by five so it is 1.05 of the old this is five of the old s so s has increased by one zero point five so it is one or we can say 100 105 divided by 100 that is stamp of percentage and T has decreased by 20%. So it will be 0 0.8 or 80%, which is 80 over 100 uh, of, the, of the T. And this is squared. Which you can see. Now you have uh, 1.05 uh, K S. You divide by, uh, you divide by, when you square 0 0.8, you get 0 0.64. Uh, t squared you divide you divide one one point zero five by uh, by zero point six four you'll be able to get that is uh, one one point six one point six four that is to two the decimal place of k s you divide by t squared so you realize here uh, this part here is the same as our r here they are the same here so what you do is you say r the new r will be 1.64 of the old r uh, implying that r has increased 
by 64%. So that's how you work out that question. Uh, you get 4 marks in the first part, the 2 marks in the second part, and 4 marks in the third part. Uh, and you have to show the working that uh, I have indicated here uh, because you don't just give the answer. We show the working, the markings, uh, the, mark, the marks are awarded uh, uh, method and the answer. So I hope you have followed that.